Hi everyone, it's Christian Joel and Michael. We just did a video for Michael. Um, we did the seven second challenge. So if you want to see that, you can click the link below. Oh, but be first, but first, but first, let's well, just watch this video. This video is kind of fun, right? But not better than mine. Yes, it is. Let's know a little bit of Michael because we really haven't heard from Michael's side on my previous videos. You know, you've oh. seen it before. We've gone to Demi Lovato. How was Demi, Demi Lovato's Lovato. concert? Good. I love her. She's my wife. Did you meet her? No. No. <laughs> Did we meet um, Miley Cyrus? No. Did but we meet it was... Selena Gomez? Shut up. Did but... we meet Selena Gomez? Yes. All right. But who was the best performer? Honestly. My desires. Mm -hmm. Today we are going to do some questions, um, getting to know each other better, um, not in those ways. But sure, we got Michael got these from some website that we don't know. Uh, I forgot. I don't even know. I just so we're it. just gonna just have some questions. So first question: Do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? What is your preference? Closed. Why? Because. My mother, I don't know some reason, I think it was my mom or someone in the family says that if you sleep with your closet door open, ghosts come into your room. With me, it depends, I guess. Um, sometimes I like it open just so that I can have a view of, mm -hmm. if it, if, you know, I can see. I'd rather see that there's no one there. But then I like it closed. But if I have it closed, sometimes I just get paranoid and I walk in and I'm like, watch somebody be in there. I get kind of scared. I did the same thing in the bathroom. I used to always like go in the bathroom and push open the curtains to see if anybody's behind the shower curtain. Yeah, I have yeah. that same fear when I'm pooping. We are playing questions, not TMI. Okay. <laughs> okay. Two, do you take the shampoos and conditioner bottles from your hotel? Mm, I don't yeah, know. Yes, I but do. But it's mean. You've done it. That's mean. That's bad for the inventory. We went, bad for the inventory. We used to work in McDonald's together and we went to a... Uh, training for management and guess who decided to take all the bottles who you me yes and in orlando when we went to orlando oh yeah i don't remember saying that okay so you're just I, you're, you're just right. you're just a self-conscious kleptomaniac you know you just do it out of nowhere i guess yeah i guess all right okay. do you sleep with your sheets tucked in or out i don't know depends I still with tucked out. I can't. I'm claustrophobic. I can't do the tucking in thing. Yeah, too tucked out. Okay, number four. Have you ever stolen a street sign before? Why would I steal a street sign? I'm not the one that printed this out. <laughs> um, I don't I'm, read the questions. Mark. I've never <laughs> stolen a street sign. I can honestly say that. I think it'd be pretty difficult. Not really. Aren't they like stuck into cement? Well, you can take the sign at the pole. Oh, that's true. No. <laughs> Number five, do you like to use post-it notes? Yes, at I work, do. I use them a lot. For at everything. work, at work only, not in real life. God knows that this guy's memory is like an empty road. It's just nothing there. Next question. I don't like, I can't even answer. I don't like post-it notes. It creates too much of a mess and then it's like everywhere. I'd rather just have a notepad, everything just written on one book and that's it. It stays on there. Don't have to take it out. Don't have to put it anywhere. Don't have to like stick it everywhere and have a big old colorful mess. But yeah. Mm. Number six, do you cut out coupons but then never use them? Yes. I use them and then I forget sometimes because I have a horrible memory just like he says. I do sometimes cut them out and don't use them but sometimes I do remember to use them. So I can say 50-50, so yes and no. Number seven, would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees? Oh my god. I guess if the bees are like following at the same time the bears was, I would get the bees honey and throw it at the bear so he's distracted, but then the bees will attack the bear so they won't get to me and then everybody's happy but the bear. All right, number eight, do you have freckles? I don't know, do I? I don't think so. They're not only on your face, you do know that, right? Well, the ones on my- oh, let's say it at the face. I don't. I, I probably do, I don't know, I don't see it. Demi does. I do, I have them um, just random places on my body. I have one here, I have one there, I have one there as well. You do? Yeah, and on my lip. Mm. 
I got the freckles. Number nine, do you always smile for pictures? Yes. Do you? Do you? Do you? <laughs> Number 10, what is your biggest pet peeve? Lazy people. It might be hard to believe, I'm lazy too. So you hate yourself, that's a pet peeve? Yes, I yourself? pet peeve myself for being lazy. So nasty. I pet peeve, I have a pet peeve of when people walk around the store, hum or whistle. It's so fucking annoying. I would actually think the one of you have people staring. Staring, oh my god, yes. I hate when people stare. And here in Hialeah, everyone has like this kind of nosiness business. Like they want to, like if you go into the neighborhood, they'll be looking at you. They act like you're intruding their, their territory. And it's like, it's getting annoying. And when you go to Walmart or whatever kind of store, people just like stare. And it's, like, I feel like freaking getting a mirror. And it's like, look at your ugly. Look at yourself. Yeah. You're not pretty. You're not pretty. In my opinion, whatever you are pretty or not, if you're just staring and you're being, you know, nosy and gross like that, then you're not pretty. You're not. Sorry. 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 Number 11. Do you ever count your steps when you walk? Sometimes. I used to do that every single day. It was an OCD that I had. But you know, this time, I don't really do that. Not really. Don't have time for that. I don't care. Number 12. Have you ever peed in the woods? Have I ever been in the woods? We've been in the closet. Yes, I have. I think, I don't even know. Number 13, what about pooped in the woods? Have you ever pooped in the woods? <laughs> Number 14, do you ever dance even if there's no music playing? Yes. 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 Totally. I'm not embarrassed, yes. I might have Beyonce in my head and I'll be like, booty delicious. Oh, uh, I was thinking single ladies. Mm, booty delicious. Got a booty. I'll put the ring on it. Ring on it. All right, so do you ever chew your penis? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> your penis. I meant to say, do you do you ever chew your pens and pencil? Pens and pencils. Mm, you can answer that for me. You probably know. Yes. Yes, I chew everything that's plastic. Everything. Sometimes probably I'll do chew on the pen, like the cap, but I don't like really go all crazy for it. I, it's disgusting to me. It's. Oh. Another puppy. One Not out of many. Sixteen. How many people have you slept with this week? <laughs> I can't so answer much. this. I plead the fifth. What size is your bed? Queen. I have a queen bed. Queen. Queen. We like queens. Go Beyonce. What is your song of the week? <laughs> if, if you go to my video, video, you, you should, would know yeah, about the song, song of the week. Video. Yeah, but yeah, if you want to know, you want to know, go on his video. Go on his video. Yeah, but no, wait until this one's done. But go on. His video. Video. Is it oh? Is it okay for guys to wear pink? Now, yes. if you saw my Easter video, you would know what I said about it. Did yes. You, what did I say? You can't wear pink, but to an extent. Um, you have to make it, you know, seem more manly. You can't just wear all pink, you pink panther. You have to take a step from it, and be selective, and make good choices. Pink. Pink is just not any other color that a guy can wear. It's something that you have to be serious about. In these tough moments of fashion, you have to be... Last question for today. Aww. Last question today. We will do these questions later, wah, but we're only gonna wah. do twenty. Um, number twenty. Do you still watch cartoons? Do I? Yeah. Mm, I, yeah. Lately, I have been. I don't know if you two have. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. I frozen. That was the last cartoon I think I watched. We are going to see Lady Gaga in about three weeks. Three weeks. Ago? Yes. Three weeks. We're also going to the gay parade. Gay pride. Gay pride. Oh yeah. 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 South Beach. Bitch. Stop cursing. Help me out. Just keep checking up on my videos and subscribe.
please. If you like my video as well, like it. And as soon as you're done with this, if you want to see more of Michael, and I know you do because you like Michael, um, go on his video to see the seven second challenge that we did today. Do you wonder? I wonder. Uh, we're Okay, so we're gonna go right now, but first... What? Let me Let's take, take a, a selfie. selfie. Bye! Bye.